Liquid Naquita? Well, actually, it's heavy liquid Naquita, but don't ask me what makes it heavy. At least not yet. Daniel, this... You okay? Yeah, it's just that... Um, strange things just keep flooding into my mind. I'm, I'm sorry, what were you saying? Well, j just that this is unbelievable. I know. What is it? Well, I guess you could call it a satellite, sir. According to Daniel, it would be capable of detecting approaching Gould ships thousands of light years away. Its weapon systems could penetrate Gould shield technology and destroy motherships. Basically, sir, it's the basis of the perfect anti Gould defense system. Of course, we need to build an entire network of them and launch them into orbit. Can we do that? Well, sir, this is an entirely new kind of technology. We'd need to bring in outside help, a lot of it. Engineers, physicists. But ultimately, it means we don't have to involve the Tok'ra. Why not? At the moment, the ghoul don't care what we're up to. We're no immediate threat. If it gets out, we suddenly advance to this level of technology, we wouldn't be able to build this defense system fast enough. You think the Tok'ra would betray us? Maybe not intentionally, but they've had problems with ghoul spies before. I don't think it's worth the risk, not when we can do this without them. I'll take that into consideration. What about the boy? Well, he doesn't have to remember anything now. He's given me all the knowledge we need. How he did that is what concerns me. He's no danger, sir. Still, as long as he's here, he should be kept under close guard. I'll talk to the Pentagon about bringing in some more personnel to help you out. Daniel Jackson. Till. I was unable to complete my Kelno Reen. What is of such importance that I should be summoned here immediately? Um. What does this mean? I believe the closest translation would be subatomic energy particles. That's what I thought, thank you. That's it, you can, uh, you can go back to whatever you were doing. Bottom line is it's going to require the resources of the entire SGC to focus on the retrieval of raw Naquita for the time being. Well, if we ask the Toker for Major help... Major Davis, you prepared a budget and timetable based on the data? The Pentagon has budgeted the construction and launch of the satellite network at $80 billion. Estimated time of completion to be two years after the start date. That's unacceptable. Well, if we involve the Russians in a cooperative effort... No. I'm sorry? I said no. The Russian government has agreed to stop using their Stargate on the condition that we share all information gathered by the SGC. Now, we have to tell no, them. No, we don't. But it's OK. I have a way of rendering their gate inactive. You do? Well, that, that's really not the point. The point is, we don't know if the Russians are turning around and trading those secrets. Now, this project is too important to get screwed up by petty Earth politics. We're talking about protecting this entire planet from Gould occupation. Well, I imagine that several of the so-called petty nations of this planet are going to be very curious when we start launching satellite weapons into orbit two years from now. One year from now. That's impossible. It, it would double the cost. Then it's not impossible, is it? Obviously, most of the workload will have to be contracted out to the private sector, so there'll have to be a strategic division of labor in order to maintain the security of the project. Major Davis, if you could also see to this. What is this? That's uh, a few personal requirements I'm sure the Pentagon will be happy to provide me with, given the nature of my continued contributions. Please see that it gets approved as soon as possible. Gentlemen. Personal requirements. <laughs> 